Colette, back to this evening at the Excelsior Stadium. Talk us through how you're feeling after that one, particularly after a late goal. Yeah, um, it was definitely a roller coaster of emotions. Um, it was such a brilliant performance from the girls, and credit to every player they stepped up, especially when City were 10 men down. I thought the team played so much better and really took advantage of um, being a player up. For yourself, obviously, scoring. The late goal, that must have felt so good, particularly coming on your weak foot as well. I think. <laughs> yeah, it all happened so quickly and I just had to swing my right foot, obviously. It's not my strongest foot, so I just swung at it and hoped for the best. And yeah, yeah celebrating, looking at the fans, it was special. And yeah, I'm buzzing. I don't think I've scored many last minute winners, so it was, it was special, but yeah, it was good. Just to touch on the fans quickly, obviously the support was fantastic here again this evening. That must help you and, and the rest of the squad. Oh, it's massive. The fans are brilliant. Um, as I've already said before, but they are the 12th man and we perform for them. They come to every game, whether it's home, away, up at Montrose, Aberdeen, they're always there, they're always singing. And we, we don't take it for granted. We love it and we do it for them and we hopefully we'll get the rewards for them. You had to remain patient and wait for that moment in the dying stages. But how much does that just tell us about this squad as a whole? Oh, it shows such character. Uh, we've been behind before um, against Hearts and we came back. In that game, we lost the goal. Uh, we equalised, but we felt within ourselves that we were going to win. Especially, um, they had 10 men. We just knew we were going to win. Um, and that's the mindset that we have this season. And it's uh, it's put on um, from the coaches and it's put on ourselves. And yeah, I'm buzzing for all the girls.